What do you do when you feel like you're about to throw up, Carson? <laughs> this is what I do. Uh, my name's James Lowe, but my nickname's Coach Ballgame, and for the last 20 years I've coached I don't know how many kids. And I want to say this before anything else. This kid, the real Carson, came to my Dallas Sandlot. I run Sandlots all over the country. He came to Dallas, probably 60 kids, and it almost made me emotional just to watch how, how good of a leader he was, how loud he cheered for everybody. Anytime somebody would get out, he would just go over to them and fist bump them and, and just unconditional love on them. So I just want to give you an attaboy on three. One, two, three. Attaboy. Um, but yeah, I'm a coach and somehow he found me. And I, I studied acting in college and I waited tables in my 20s and then I got married and had kids. So it was like, I gotta feed them. So <laughs> I, guess I, I guess I better coach. Uh, so I did that. but. I, I, I always told my agents and managers, I think I'm going to really hit it when I'm 40. And they love that. <laughs> but here I am, 40, and uh, I'm able to really marry my two loves, baseball and art. And um, me and Lee, as soon as we got on the phone together, we just started unpacking story and character. And, and I have this chip on my shoulder. As I've coached for years, there's this kind of toxic energy that has seeped into youth sports where it's all win at all costs, yell at the umpire, uh, be you know on the most elite team, and then all these non-elite players are weaned out and all these kids in blue jeans are looking over the bushes like, I kind of like that game, but I'm not invited. Uh, it, it's too much for me. And uh, so I kind of came into it with, with a little bit of anger. Like, I, I want to change the culture of youth sports and we just started talking about that and so that message of positivity and i saw it firsthand with the kids like you should see you should have seen what we did after we shot we we would play kickball and we would just hang out together and curtis pride was just crushing us with dodgeball um <laughs> it, uh, but I, I, I got emotional at one point. Uh, it was during the, uh, one of the scenes where I'm wearing that onesie. Uh, and, and all these kids, uh, one kid was having a bad day, just, just having a bad day. And the whole group just rallied around them. And I was like, man, this positivity thing, it's really, there's something there. Um, so I uh, kind of lost track of where I was, but. <laughs> Anyway, it was a great experience. All right, I'm going to go out to the audience.